Hello everybody. Uh, we're going up to Sheboygan so I can finally get my key rig and some of the cups for it. And Don needs shoes because he's been wearing pieces of crap for like since 2017 I think. That's pretty bad. So he needs new shoes. And sometime today the chain for that snowblower gets delivered by UPS so that's good. At least that didn't take very long. We ordered it on Saturday and here it is Tuesday and it's going to be here so Don will put that on the snowblower later and then it should be fine. Talking to yourself again. Yeah, oh we picked the same shirt today. Jeez. This ain't the, this ain't the damn Bobsy Twins, you know. Yeah, well, they had these shirts for a dollar at Walmart last month or whatever and we're like, huh, a dollar? So I marked the inside collar of mine with some markers so I know which one is mine and which one is his. Yeah, well, you could, couldn't buy the material to make them for that price. No, it's because they were getting rid of their summer stock. Yeah. And and that's one of the good things about Walmart is when they change seasons, the clothes from the season before go really, really cheap. Yeah. But we're going to leave in a minute here. Yeah. Like tug in. Yeah. And go to leave. Yep. That way when the ups guy shows up to drop off the part, then Yeah, he doesn't have to be there. scared of a dog. UPS isn't so bad about it. It's no. the mail, the... United States Postal Service, who seems to be horrified of dogs leaving uh, cards in your mailbox saying, All dogs bite! So, yeah. that's not fair. Yes, all dogs can bite, but Tug doesn't bite. He's just an old border collie. Leave him alone. Yep, all dogs bite. So you better get away from him because I bite. Yeah. So there's the Keurig. Only $59, and they were like 250 bucks when they first came out. And this is it out of the box. I wanted the blue one, not the red one or the black one. I wanted a color that was different. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, obviously we just got home and Don's starting to bring the stuff in and then I'll get it put away. I mean, you can't see him out there, right there. But anyway, the chain for the snowblower came. So I already cut it open, but I didn't look at it. Oh, come on. A magnet. Two. Two magnets. And then it's in here. But Don will be able to put that on and uh, come on. There. He'll be able to put it on and get that going. Snow, snow blower. There we go. So that's good. That was the only, well, except it needing a new battery, but it can be jumped in the meantime until we get another battery. And these are the cups I bought, macadamia cookie. I saw that one of the last times we were at Walmart and I thought it looked like it would be good. And then I bought this for Don because he's always talking about how he wants really strong coffee. So I think something called death cups might be strong enough for him. The world's strongest single serve coffee pods. Well, when I get it out of the box and get it set up. You ain't got it out of the box yet? No. You slacker. And anyway, we already had these French vanilla and premium. So for right now, we have plenty. And I also picked these up for our regular coffee, coffee pot because Don doesn't like using the paper ones. And his last one of these fell all apart. And then we have such rusty water that it's good to have these filters. So what do your shoes look like? I didn't even see them. Oh, well, nothing fancy. Just straight up black shoes. Open nothing it. fancy about them at all. Oh, better nothing than what fancy. you're wearing. Look at that crap. Well, I left all that my, uh, Told say hello to you out the side. Yeah, you? and your other pair of boots or whatever is really crappy too, aren't they? Oh, yeah, the inside are falling apart. Yeah, those over there, so these will be better. Yeah, I told you 
You needed shoes and you weren't going to get away with not getting shoes. Yeah, these were on clearance for 25 bucks. Yeah. Originally 34 84 Yeah, so, so hopefully they'll bucks. last you. So almost 10 bucks cheaper than what they normally are. So. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to unbox this now. Let's see what all is in here. I've never had one of these before, so... book and cardboard. Okay, here's the actual keyring itself. It's upside down. all over the place. Okay. Another piece, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I was just going to say another piece right there. throw the box away right away in case something's wrong. I always do that. But I'm going to bring it over here. This is where it's going to be. I see another piece of tape on the back. If you turn around you'll see it. To read the instructions don't know never had one before okay it's running a, a cleansing thing a cleansing brew to rinse it out since it was new and then after that we should be able to use it like normal so we'll see it's been confusing for me because I've never had one of these before, and I'm sure all of you who have who've had them for the last 10 or 15 years are laughing at me. Because you all know exactly what's going on. I know nothing. There, now that that's done, I can put one of these in there. I have iced coffee from Burger King for right now, so Don gets the first cup. And it says to put it in there and don't take this off. Considering it only filled this halfway, I guess we'll pick this one. That's pretty quick. Wow. Wow, that smells strong. Death coffee. That's what he likes though. Really, really strong coffee that I can't stand. So that box is his. So anyway, this is a pretty big cup. So it needed that button. Our smaller mugs are gonna need that button. Or, or that one, whichever. There. There, light went off. Your coffee's ready. 
Coffee ready. Yeah, can you smell it? Yeah, it smells good. Well, here you go. So, now that I figured it out, it's not that hard, but... Bring, ooh, that's just hot. Well, yeah. You fingered it out? Yeah. Taste it. <laughs> you might have to put something in it, cream and sugar or something, but... I want to know if this is strong enough for you. You always want your strong coffee. Yeah, it's good. You like it that way? A little too hot, need a little shot of water just to cool it off a tad. <laughs> That's probably not enough. <laughs> well, I just want to pull up that. I want to dilute it. Yeah. Pulled it off about a quarter of a degree. So is death cough, death wish coffee strong enough for you? Yeah, it was about like when I grabbed the first cup out of the coffee maker when it first brewed its first Yeah. Cup. Well, good then. Later on tonight, I'll try my macadamia cookie stuff, but I have my iced coffee to finish first. Yeah, because in the coffee maker, I put one big heaping scoop in, then I get another half of the scoop and I dump that in. Jeez. Well, we got a pretty big scoop. Yeah. So I think it's a three tablespoon scoop. Just keep right over as much as I can get it balanced <laughs> on there. Then I dump that in, and like I said, then I have another one. Yeah. You so. want coffee that punches you in the mouth. <laughs> no, I want coffee that'll make you lose hair in places you don't want to lose it and make you grow hair in places you don't want it. Oh, yeah. That's the kind of coffee I like. <laughs> Hi, White Storm. Maybe that's why I'm getting a bald spot on the and back. And gizzard. Of my head. Probably not. Yeah, look, it's getting thin. Yeah, but I don't think that's why. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Cute kitties. Oh, the green's going by. Yep. So, I tried, just tried the macadamia cookie K cup, and that's really, really good. You have to put some unflavored creamer and a little bit of sugar in there, at least I do. But for people that don't do that, it's fine. Don's just making dinner. Yeah. Blurry. 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 Hold on. Yay, the world is clear again. We're just having chicken and onion rings for dinner. Right, you two? You guys are just waiting. Oh, so are you. Gizzard is somewhere. And you're waiting. But tomorrow I have a doctor's appointment really early in the morning again. Thunder Bay Health Center loves to get you there at the crack of dawn. So we're going to go ahead and end this so that I can edit it and get it ready to go up tomorrow before I have to go to bed. So we're going to say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Oh, and I forgot to say, he'll probably be doing the snowblower chain tomorrow, right? Yeah. Say good night. Hey, good morning. Look at the camera. Well, I'm trying to take plates. Yeah, well, you can look for a second. No, I can't. I don't know how. Yep. I, I can't multicast. And we'll see you next time.